So I've developed a program for every part of our body, and it starts again with cleansing. We talked about cleaning the skin on the face. When we clean the skin on the body, we use this bath shower jelly. And why this rather than other bath gels? Because again, this is non-drying. It's gently exfoliating. It has green tea in it. And th what is that? That is a very wonderful antioxidant. And it has aloe, so it's soothing. I use this every day in the bath. And you can also use it in the shower. I have my patients using this after body surgery because it's gentle, helps exfoliate, and gets rid of all of those dead cells. So this is something to use every single day. Now, what's the next step? We want to exfoliate with a skin smoothing. We had the skin smoothing for the face. Now we want a skin smoothing for the body. And the skin isn't the same all over. The skin on the face is much more delicate than on the arms or the stomach or the legs. So we can use an exfoliator that's slightly stronger. So this has an increased strength of glycolic acid, but it also has vitamin E, and it has lipoic acid, giving our skin the ingredients, the antioxidants it needs to really work more effectively. We eat right, we exercise, and we want to look better. Part of looking better is making our skin soft, supple, firmer, and that's what this is about. Now, what else can we do? Moisturize our body. Moist skin, soft skin, is supple skin, is healthy skin. And so I developed a body moisturizing lotion, again, with lipoic acid, vitamin E and A, and also soy. Soy is a very natural way of replacing estrogen. And for women going through menopause, this can have a profound effect on the skin. And so this is a way of giving yourself those things that you need to give your skin the health and the youth it needs.